Okay, so we are live. We already have people joining us to watch your skin lesion removal. Wonderful. Big Red has joined us. T Gibbs has joined us. Shannon's joined us. I, I never can't pronounce her right, name right. I think it's Gross Crutz. Yeah. Uh, Fred Forerun, Fun, Funner, Ferner. So we're going to get a little measurement here of this lesion. For everybody joining us here, we, we are going to shave that lesion that you see on the patient's back. This is a patient with a great sense of humor, so. And, and we're not going to forget the, the, the anesthetic part. We're not going to forget the anesthetic. <laughs> she does not like having the anesthetic forgot. So you can see kind of relative size there. That's a almost one centimeter in length. You can kind of see the ink uh, that I drew around it, a circle around it to mark where it was so that uh, Jessica was able to put in the, the prep. That's the iodine that's around it. It looks a lot like these other skin lesions. If you look over here, you see something that is a inflamed seborrheic keratosis. Now on the camera, you can't see what it really looks like. On the camera, when I look at that, I go, oh, that thing needs to be biopsy. That looks like potentially to be a malignant melanoma. But it, it, in reality, it, looking at it, it looks different from that. Oh, somebody asked a question. I missed it. Sorry about that. I was talking too much. Are you doing a shave, Dr. Mark? We will be doing a shave, Jessica. Okay. Some of you may know Jessica. Jessica, from what, what's your Twitter handle? At Jessica N. Marino. N. Marino? The letter N? N. Yeah. Jessica N. N. Marino. Marino. M O R E. -N -N. She's on Periscope also. You might want to catch that. Everybody says hi, Jessica. Shannon hi. Gross Kritz. I'm really working on it. She told me last night how to pronounce it. You doing okay? Yeah. Right. See, this is a different I'm way of doing fine. it, isn't it? It's like. Y yes, it is. It's like you have a whole lot of really, people. Just like... So I'm going to leave you with Jessica while I go do a. Uh, Preparation of anesthetic tonight. Good idea. And I'll take my audience with me. Mm -hmm. I'll tell them. I'll put you there. Our periscope participants. <laughs> so, uh, and I should show you, you get lots of hearts. Can you see all those hearts? They tap the screen to make hearts when they like what's going on. Oh, <laughs> oh God. You know. I get entertained too. Uh, <laughs> so let's, let's go get some anesthetic and. Oh, look at that. Nobody's even around here. Nobody's around. End of the day. Why? Am I going to set that up so you guys can... Oh, rapid fire thumb. Yes, Big Red. You keep that thumb going. Can I set it up there? Do you guys get dizzy watching this? Because it's always moving. And Danielle says she's funny. She's, she's a kick. I will tell you that. Okay, I have to go get a, a syringe from over here. I will be back. I'm using safety syringes. It's a heart party. Now I give you guys hearts. Okay, so this is what I'm using. This is one of those safety syringes. The uh, sleeve can come out over past the needle for when you're done so that when you put it in the sharps container, you don't poke yourself on the way. There's a gigantic needle to go into the bottle of anesthetic and you guys know my cocktail because you've seen it before lidocaine with epinephrine and sodium bicarbonate so here's how we go I like to get two cc's of the lidocaine with epinephrine and then I get 0.2 of the sodium bicarbonate. And what that does is buffers the acidity of the lidocaine so that it's not so acidic. And then it won't sting as badly when you inject it. Another thing I do, oh, I wouldn't let anyone come near me with that needle. Ah, it's gone. What's a CC? Uh, Cubic centimeter or milli millimeter, uh, milliliter, excuse me, milliliter. So this is the tiny needle, and I inject slowly. So tiny needles, slow injecting, buffer for the anesthetic. These are all things that help to make it not sting when giving a shot. I would appreciate that if I was giving a shot. I know, because someone's got a shot without it. Okay. So. Usually more stylish than that. 
I wouldn't wear these with a skirt. <laughs> Talking says, style. Yeah. Let me switch the camera around. Are you okay with holding? Uh, when we actually, and we're not using the microphone for this because the cable gets in the way of doing the procedures. Okay. Can we show your style in shoes? Do we have permission? <laughs> well, why not? Yeah. We'll show your new Brooks that you got to match yeah. your, your dress. My $120 shoes that are not really terrible. No, I was not. Hmm. Who's Done a film some major? acting. Yeah. He's asking if I was a film major. A film major? No. You're a medical assistant. Yes. I'm... <laughs> I guess you can be both. Yeah, I have done both. I mean, I've done film, but. What did you do? What are some films that you're in, Jessica? Um, I was in commercials. Commercials, was okay. Yeah. More as a young. So was that back when your dad was? My uh, dad pushed it. <laughs> when he was on chips and. Yes. Was uh, now he is union, right? Your dad. Yes, he is the SAG part of SAG. He is SAG. What about you, anonymous patient? Have you done any acting? Oh, absolutely, on stage. You were on the no stage. Movies. Yeah, local stuff, you know. I've been an extra in movies. Does that count? Yeah, that counts. What have you been in? I don't even know. I was 18 and it was just like I wanted to have some extra money and my dad told me about this gig and I was like, sure. So was he in it too? No. Oh, I thought maybe you guys did as a family. I once did one with, with my brother. Um, it was a very low budget independent thing here in, the, in Northern California called Unflinching Triumph. Oh, that sounds... And it was about underground um, stare down competition. Underground, underground competitions yeah you know the first one to blink loses yeah and so th there was this uh traveling circuit of stare down competitors and all the drama that goes on behind the scenes mm. between the uh, participants mm, somebody says yikes does it even hurt are you talking to me yes i yeah, am they want to know if you hurt no no well, by now, you're probably numb. Yeah, I'm going around a lot of places because it's not puffing up the way I usually like it to. Yeah. And so we're going to use the Dr. Believe me, if it hurt, I'd be saying ooch or ouch or something. <laughs> you or shrieking. Shrieking? I've never heard you shriek. No, I'm not listening to shriek. How many years have we been doing this? <laughs> we some no. We've been doing this in a while. Stuff works really well. Wound seal. Back in January, the, the, I went into the doctor, uh, the, the dermatologist, uh, Dr. Hirth, yes. for a complete body scan. And we just put that in there. To he didn't find anything okay. that looked evil, except for a couple on my front, which turned out not to be evil. Can you feel what I'm doing to you here? I just feel pressure. No pinch? No. In that case, it's time to rock and roll with this. <laughs> That's what it means. Okay, this is not for the squeamish. Go ahead and get as close Viewer as you can. Viewer discretion is advised. Viewer discretion is advised. You may ask more sensitive members of the audience to look away from the phone. <laughs> All right, so we'll put that in the. I'll put it in the mm -hmm. sample container that goes to the pathologist, mm -hmm. where it will be sectioned and stained, and then. Okay. I'm just let, let me. Uh, we're gonna take turns here. Okay. So can the blood flow. I am going to. Take I can it. still hold the phone and uh, do the wound seal. Uh, okay. We do not want to compromise patient care. <laughs> okay. It's not that bad, so okay. go ahead. Let me just show it to you and then go ahead and do okay. it. Okay. You ready? Okay, so pour it on. Let's pour it on, pour it on, pour it on. There you go, good. What did we pour on there? It's called wound seal. Oh, okay. It's like a powder that is it's all a powder. powder. Okay. Like it. Uh, it causes an artificial scab to form within a minute. Okay. That's why I'm counting in my head for the minute. Cool stuff. When you were using the word pour, I'm envisioning liquid. You know what I want? 
Is that running all over my new skirt? <laughs> uh, <laughs> No, that's the blood in the right no, okay. Somebody says, poor lady, I feel for her. Oh, so you're getting sympathy out of Oh, well, tell them I appreciate the sympathy. And they give you lots of parts. <laughs> the purple ones match your dress. Oh, good. <laughs> Any comments? Oh, they're talking to each other? They're pretty much, yeah, yeah, some of that and some comments, just like, ew, gross, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> Don't ever go in the medical maybe, field then. Maybe, maybe we should tell them not to watch shave biopsies. Or maybe we should put up like a hashtag medical procedure with blood. Yeah. Weed out the squeamish. But anybody who comments here is actually a follower of me. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I rigged it for that. I'll give you hearts, doctor, but this is not for the squeamish like me. <laughs> she gives us hearts anyways. <laughs> What's happened to this lady? Oh, this was just a skin lesion that looked very irritated, and we just want to make sure it's not turning into something malignant by shaving it off. And that one gets rid of it, and two allows us to get a, a know, biopsy to find out what it is in case there's any of it left behind after the biopsy. We know to come back and get it. And come out and dig out a big divot. Big, in my big back. divot. I don't think that's going to be necessary. And you got to thank you, patient, for allowing oh. us to watch. So they're oh. thanking you. You're welcome. And so that's art, an artificial scab. It looks mm. kind of like cinnamon. Yeah. Let me take that from you so you can do your part. Okay. Could it grow back? It can, especially if we didn't go deep enough. Deep enough, okay. But then again, if you go too deep, you actually go all the way through the skin, mm -hmm. and then you have a lesion that's hard to, to heal in. Well, yeah. Down into the... And you're welcome, Sheena. Down to the... Down past mm -hmm. the uh, skin and <laughs> into the, the fat layer that we have around it. Oh, is that a hole? No, that's not a hole. That's that's the powder that we poured on top of the surface. We just shaved off a thin shave. In fact, we can look at the. It's over here in the bottle, mm -hmm. the actual thin little shave that came off, and that's going to go to the um, pathologist. Well, somebody says this is a great medical team, boy. Aww. They're, they're very complimentary. Tell him, tell him that he should give me a raise. Though. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. They're, they're going to say that after that. Let me throw this into the uh, the red can. The red can being the one that we put anything that had blood on it. Those, those are inside out. That's why I can touch them. Uh, the scab will heal. Yeah, it actually has an artificial scab on it. Yeah, Big Red says you need a raise. Okay. <laughs> so I'll go finish up the paperwork. Thank you, everybody, for participating. And uh, so it's just gonna have a big scab on it that's gonna fall off gradually over okay. time like a scab would. So I'm getting a big band-aid on this too, or you don't need one. Or now. this this artificial just, scab thing. We is... we we just take off all the uh, loose yeah. powder. Yeah. And she's taking off all the beta nine, so you don't have all that yellow color on it. Well, good. Mm -hmm. Most people are saying if, you, if I looked closer, you'd be my doctor. Aww. Everybody donate to the Jessica Fund. Yeah. Jessica, you're gonna have to run with this. Um, <laughs> What is it again? Jessica Go fund me. N, the letter N, Moreno. Jessica N Moreno, M O R E N O. Moreno, okay. Jessica N Moreno, at Jessica N Moreno. She has her own, and you sing, right? Yes. You sing praise songs yep. to, to the to the phone. Yep, I do. I, I, I take you guys to my practices, our worship practices. Oh, at church. And you yep. wear more makeup than you Yes, do. I normally look a lot prettier. You, yeah, you dress. <laughs> I. I <laughs> Nothing like makeup. Boys. I do my hair and my makeup. <laughs> They're saying, go Jessica, cool. Aww. Yeah. <laughs> and Shannon says, cool. Okay. Awesome. Go fund. Go go fund this yeah. poor medical assistant worship leader. Yes, yes that's right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and her husband with their family. Yeah. Okay, thank you guys all for joining us. Thank you for all the hearts. And uh, if you have friends who are interested, just swipe right and share so that they can participate in the fun. I hate to turn off with all the hearts going, but I have to get to work. So, but... <laughs> And our patient needs to get dressed and go through. <laughs> Thanks again. Thank you all. <laughs>